Hey dolls and gents, I'm coming back to you guys with the combined April and May favorites video. I'm gonna show you guys the beauty products I was loving in the past two months. And first I'm gonna start off with Lush Grease Lightning. I absolutely love this stuff. I accidentally, well it wasn't accidentally, but I did fall asleep in my makeup when I went out a week ago. It was like a week and a half ago. And I had to apply this the next day like all over my face because I started to break out like crazy. And now I use this underneath my makeup every day it keeps my breakouts at bay absolutely love this stuff holy girl product next I want to talk about the e pearl priming moisturizer and I've been loving this as a moisturizer but also as a primer on the skin it just really helps to moisturize the skin but it also helps the makeup to stay on all day and prevent it from being really shiny and keeping on your makeup I love you guys it. know I love brightened under eye area I love using a concealer that's a couple shades lighter than my skin tone and lately I've been using the Mac pro longwear and NW 40 I really love to apply it with my fingers right underneath the eye area I pat it out until pretty much it's dry and then I'll apply my Ben Nye banana powder over top just to set it but it just gives me that highlighted look underneath my eyes that awakened look and it covers up my dark circles I love it I'm wearing it today and I think it's bomb so my favorite mascara lately has been the Maybelline illegal lens mascara and this mascara really reminds me of the Maybelline lash stiletto except for this mascara has little fibers in it the wand is exactly like lash stiletto but the only thing is it has little fibers on it to help grasp your natural lashes and extend them farther and what I really love this mascara for is using it under the bottom lash line to pull these lashes down and make them long and lush this mascara is bomb for your bottom eyelashes I've been loving two liners this month the first one is max molder eye coal I've been using this over my feline this is the one I've just been grabbing for a when I want a dark black eyeliner around the rim of my eyes and for winged eyeliner I've been using the Milani ultra fine liquid eyeliner in black vinyl this is amazing I love it I used it on my lash line today to do winged eyeliner and I think it's bomb okay you guys know I normally don't talk about brushes in my favorites video but this brush is so good I've got to mention it this one is by Samantha Chapman here on YouTube one of the pixie woo sisters and this is a real techniques brush and this is their powder brush this brush is so freaking soft I love it for applying my powder and if you guys have been wondering what powder I've been loving it is the Mac mineralized skin finish in deep dark I love this powder I finally picked up a new one because you guys know I hit pan majorly and I have been showing you guys it in my last get ready with me video and you guys have been like you need a new one so I picked up a new one I love this stuff it's really good especially during summertime it gives you that glow but it also sets your makeup in place and it's really light in coverage so the foundation I've been loving this month is the time bomb by the bomb and it is a cream foundation and I use this with a stippling brush I'll stipple it in there and then I'll just blend it onto my skin really nice or I'll use a flat top brush I love this foundation I really haven't used a cream foundation since that Mac one and I forgot what it was called I think it was like the mineralized foundation or something like that but this foundation is really nice my shade in this is after dark I think this is the darkest shade it's really nice color I really love the coverage it's like a medium coverage but you can build it up to a full coverage I think you guys should try out this foundation and let me know what you think about it it does have like a weird smell to it it doesn't smell bad but doesn't smell good either but yeah that's the only thing about so it next I've definitely got to talk about the covergirl bronzer and ebony bronze hit pan majorly on this thing I love this I use this in pretty much every single one of my makeup tutorials anytime I'm wearing makeup in my contour I'm always wearing this bronzer I love how it warms up the skin it's summertime now so we definitely need some bronzer ladies and just because you're of a darker complexion does not mean you don't have to wear bronzer bronzer looks good on any skin tone whether you're your light or dark it looks great so now that we've talked about bronzer I definitely got to mention some of my favorite highlighters and I've definitely been loving the Mary Luminizer from the bomb and I had to repress mine because it got all shattered up because I traveled with it and I guess I didn't cover it too well so that's why the texture looks like that 
but it still looks really great. It's really pigmented. I have it right now on the highest points of my cheekbone and I absolutely love it. I've also been loving the Tarte Maracuja Blush and Glow and this one is in Candlelight. This one is a liquid highlighter and it is bomb too, especially if you're wearing a tinted moisturizer. You can mix it a little bit with your tinted moisturizer to make it a little bit dewy or you can apply it just to the tops of your cheekbone over the tinted moisturizer and it looks so good. You guys have got to try a liquid highlighter if you haven't tried one yet. My favorite blush lately has been this NARS Pierre Hardy Inspired Blush and this one is called Boys Don't Cry. I use this in one of my last get ready with me videos and if you guys do not have this you need to go to Sephora you need to go to NARS and get this bad boy no matter what skin tone you are you need this in your life and it's limited edition so you better go now this blush I would say is a peachy kind of orangey coral blush and it has a layer of this gold on top and you guys can see the gold is almost gone I'm kind of sad about that so it has a natural highlight in it but once the gold layer is gone it's just a matte blush so for eyeshadow I have been loving Mac stars and rockets eyeshadow it's a really cool eyeshadow because it's dual chrome so if you apply it over a black base it's gonna show a completely different color and it's dual chrome just like a purple color it's a blue color and sometimes it kind of even looks pinky so if you apply it over a black base it looks more blue but if you apply it over a white base or over just an eyeshadow primer it's gonna to come out more purple so this eyeshadow is bomb on the bottom lash line or on the lid I love this eyeshadow it is amazing you need it in your life so eyebrows I've been obsessed with my eyebrows I do my eyebrows normally that's the first thing I do when I do my makeup so I've been using the Milani brow fix and this one is in dark and I use this darkest shade here it's like a cool tone matte brown eyeshadow and I use that on my brows today I love it. it is bomb and it's very inexpensive so check this out if you're looking for a brow powder guys. Couple more items to show you guys it's definitely a must-have that you get a makeup spray for summertime and I've been loving the Urban Decay all-nighter spray this is the XL one I'm almost out of this so I need to get another one but this stuff keeps your makeup on all day this makeup I've had on my face since earlier this morning because I did my meet-and-greet today so shout out to everyone who came I really appreciate it I had so much fun with you guys but back to the all-nighter spray this makeup has been on my face all freaking day and my face might look oily but my makeup still looks beat okay so, I've got three more products to share with you guys and they're all lip products two of the products I'm wearing on my lips right now so first product is Dior lip glow and I can't really show you what it looks like because that's all I have left I love this stuff it moisturizes the lips but it brings out the natural pinky kind of fleshy tone in your lips which I love and I love topping it with Revlon super lustrous lip gloss and pink pop this has been my go-to lip lately you guys have been asking me in my last videos what's that pink lip you're wearing it's been this you guys I love it so the last lipstick I want to talk to you guys about is from Mac and I can't believe that I didn't pick it up until last month because guys I have been sleeping on this lipstick and this is cream cup from Mac it's a cream sheen lipstick and this lipstick is great it's a pinky nude you guys know I love my pink lipsticks I know some of you guys are not big fans of pink lipsticks but I love pink lipsticks if I had to choose a lipstick color to wear every day it would be pink this one is an everyday lipstick for me I love it you can apply a brown lip liner around your lips to make it not look as pink and blend it in and it looks gorgeous you guys have got to check this out if you don't have it already I'm super excited to share with you guys this giveaway that I'm gonna do I'm gonna be giving away all of my favorite beauty products for this month to one of you guys so 
All you have to do is be subscribed to my YouTube channel. You have to be 18 years or older. This contest is open internationally. All I want you guys to do is comment on this video down below and let me know what you would like to see more on my channel. Would you like to see more giveaways, more makeup tutorials, more outfits of the day? Let me know in the comments down below, you guys. And the winner is definitely going to have to tell me their shades and all of the foundation colors that I have because I want to get the right shades for you guys. So. I'm not gonna get these products until I know the shade of the winner, okay? So I definitely want you guys to like this video, share this video with your friends on any social medias, whether it be Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, wherever you wanna share it. I appreciate you guys continued love and support. You guys mean everything to me. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.